This example says, a survey of middle school students found that 25 out of 40 students would prefer having juice instead of chocolate milk at lunch. Suppose there are 800 students in the school. Based on the survey, how many do you predict prefer having juice instead of chocolate milk? All right, so the important information is 25, 40, and 800. So first step, what you do is you have to find the ratio. In this case, 25 divided by 40 gives you 0 and 625 thousandths. You multiply it by the number of students in the school, and that gives you 500. This means that 500 students out of 800 would prefer having juice instead of milk. The next example is the same exact thing. A survey of middle school students found that 40 out of 55 would prefer having hot dogs instead of burgers at lunch. If there are 570 students in the school, they want to know how many would prefer having hot dogs instead of burgers at lunch. Important information is 40, 55, and 570. You go through the same process. You find the ratio, 40 out of 55. In this case, it gives you 0 0.7272, and that repeats itself. So what you do is you multiply that decimal by 570, and it'll give you your answer, which turns out to be 414.5. So we round it off, because we can't have a half a student and we get 415 students altogether. This says that 415 students would prefer to have hot dogs instead of burgers.